We hold our breath when our sons go to the corner store for a snack, praying that the next time we see him won't be in a chalk outline. We hold our breath when they drive home from HBCUs and PWIs for vacations that we hope won't end in tragedy in a headline. We hold our breath when we lose one because we know that they'll be vilified and animalized and some overprivileged, undereducated ne'er-do-well will say that he needed to be put down or some pontificating pundit will pronounce him a thug, which is simply cold for we don't see you as human. We hold our breath when we see blue lights behind us because we know that one wrong move could put us on the news and the story they tell won't reflect who we are. We hold our collective breath waiting for the day when we are seen as more than the political agendas that you use to hide your white guilt. We've held our breath for so long that we can't breathe. It's time to breathe.